understand what I must do. Oh shit, hold on. Oh look, now I do. There's another fucking big boy here. Or it's the big boy, I don't know. You again? Persistent thing, aren't you? Uh oh. Just as we learned about him. There he is. He a big boy. Oh yes he is. Well then. Guess we're gonna run back inside, eh? Get him, T-Rex. Get him. Let him know. Be that ankle biter. Oh god. Well. Good night, T-Rex. It was nice knowing you. handle it. I guess we're not going back out that way. <laughs> How the fuck did you get here? Dylan, you scared me. I finally found the third energy data disk. Great. Now we can get out of here. I brought the patrol ship around behind the building. Come on, let's go. What? Is there a Cyclops threatening him? It can't be. That T-Rex is already... Attack on missile launcher confirmed. Activating emergency interception mode. Missile will launch in 10 minutes. Evacuate immediately. The computer is malfunctioned. This is not good. Where's the control panel for the missile? It's inside the warhead. I'll go in and shut off the controller. You go ahead and evacuate. Okay. You be careful. I'll go shut it down. You escape uh, alive and well. Okay. Wow, this sounds already like this is like the last sequence, doesn't it? Dearming a fucking nuclear warhead while the biggest dinosaurs around. Sounds like we're almost done, dude. This game's hella short if it's a, if we are. Big Dino, how you doing? Good. This looks good. Looks safe. You have 10 minutes to disarm the emergency interception mode of the missile warhead. The key to beating the giant dinosaur is to use the flammable gas energy injection terminal on the walkway. You got it, dude. Currently, the plug to the missile is removed. Will you press the switch? Yep. I don't know what that. Okay. Okay, well, I'm gonna die. Get up, you fool! All he did was growl at you didn't even do anything. Okay, you want to hit that. I see. Control terminal. The access route to the missile launcher has been closed due to the emergency interception mode. Well, shit on that. God damn it. Run! I don't know where I'm supposed to go, honestly. They wanted me to shut it down. I get it. But what? what oh. Get up, you fool! You fool! How did it not hit him? Like, I don't understand. Am I supposed to actually do something to him? Can't be operated. Well, fucking neat. Oh my god. So is the idea to just keep hitting him with this mist until something happens? Get up. Get up. Get up. Get, get, get up. Am I supposed to be shooting at this guy? I don't even know, man. Like, 
I have a rocket launcher, we could try that out, I guess. That seemed to do something. Maybe? Maybe not. Ah, okay. Okay, now I got you. I got you. I was like, while the steam, yeah, that's what I was thinking. Like, fl flame on with the steam on? That makes sense. Anyway, that makes sense. Okay. Shit! There we go. That seems easy. That seems, that seems straightforward. Alright, you know, let's, let's pop, pop quick one of these. Also, I could totally pick up one of those health things. I didn't even realize I had space for it. I guess I don't really need to use the rocket launcher for this, huh? Um, probably just use, honestly, we could probably just use the flamethrower, which I never use anyways. Get up, you fool! This is no time to be taking a nap. I'm gonna go grab those heals real quick. I will take the med pack, thank you. I cannot carry anymore. Damn it! Stop it! No! Stop! Why does the growl have to knock you on your ass? It's such a pain. Is this accomplishing anything? I'm still unclear. Am I just supposed to do this till he dies? Like, what? I can do this all day. This is not hard. This is back and forth. Like, I don't even have to get hit very much if I just do it right. Damn it. Stop. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Okay. I am doing it right because now something's happening. I got him. Eat dicks, you giant dino fuck. Because the dino was there, those bridges went down. He's probably not even dead. But, you know, that's just my thought process. So we got seven minutes. Let's get up there. Hold on one quick check. Uh, I have a large, I have a small. Let's use the small so I can pick up whatever this is. I think it's just... Wait, this must be a medium then. If, that's, if I could pick it up, then this must be a medium. Okay, okay I'll take that. Better than running around with a small. Alright. Let's get up there, shall we? Actually. Power of the bridge is shut down at the moment. Program to restart the power is displayed on the screen. Will you restart? Yes, I will, please. Oh. Oh, shit. It's one of these. Oh, no. I don't have my gun. I don't have my... Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. Got it. It's one of these. Alright, it's fine. It was a fine mini game. Shit, just don't miss. Don't miss. Don't play with me. Don't play with it. It's nuts, dude. Nice, we got it. Woo! I thought it was gonna be like one at a time, like last time we did one of those. I can't believe I did it on the first try. That was pretty good. That was pretty good. Some Final Fantasy VII shit going on here with this music and this situation. Quick, up the tower, up the reactor, quickly. <laughs> Let's 
control terminal for the warhead. You can open the cover of the warhead. Yes, I will. Emergency interception mode is activated. Will you stop the program? Yes. Emergency interception mode has been deactivated. Wow, I did it with five minutes to spare. That was overkill. Well then. On our way out, time to get murdered by a giant dinosaur. You know that bitch ain't dead. His legs are still there. His legs are still there. Yep, here it comes. <gasps> he alive. Run, Regina, run! He gon' kill you! You do know when it's a giant, like, vertical pillar, you could jump to the side, right? Just saying. <laughs> well, great. Now things are on fire. Good job. Attention. Missile destroyed. Woot. Warning. Warning. Shit. Armed. Not woot. Evacuate immediately. Well, I don't see a timer yet, so let's save it. If there's ever a time to save it, now's the time. Now's the fucking time! Alright, um, I don't have enough of this heavy machine, which, I, you know what? I really, I honestly believe we're, like, in the last sequence now. The warhead is activated, we need to get the fuck out of here. Like, that's gotta be the game, dog. But I'm gonna reload all my shit, because something tells me there's a reason why that it's even here, other than just being able to save. You never know what you might have to throw down with. Also, what do they sell here? Fucking gold card? Go shopping and have all the rewards? Get some good frequent flyer miles and shit? I'm down. Alright. Let's go. Let's get out this bitch. I don't even know where I am right now. This is not a recognizable area for me. Back door access. Wait. Oh, hello. What the fuck are these guys doing here? Okay. That's fine. I got exactly what I need to fight your ass. Check it. Boo! Oh, well, that's the wrong button. Bitch. What you even think about fucking with me? You ain't want none. Aw, oh, man. Uh, turn around. Okay, or you can just do that. That's cool. Uh, dude, if other dude wants some, he can have some. I'm just gonna keep moving. Shook him! Just line him up, just line him up. Oh god! I wasn't expecting him to rush at me like that. Door access. Oh yeah. Oh god damn it. Fuck off. Alright, quick question. What's the map looking like? Uh okay. Pretty straightforward to me. Just keep moving. Shit. Back up, bitch. We're good. I won't need this handgun on the way out of here, probably, so I'm okay with just, like, kind of using it up. Save my other good stuff for whatever the hell's coming up. 
Are you okay, Regina? Get on, quick. Oh, give me a break, man. We're dead. What do you mean? We're only dead if you don't fucking stand there. Or if you do stand there. We have to get as far away from this place as possible. Let's head down the river. Heading on down the river. Gonna survive that shit. Riverside front of Watergate. Gonna survive that shit. Aw, oh, yeah. Great. The Watergate closed. We can't go any further. Wait, there's a valve. Maybe we can open the gate manually. Whoa. Let the men handle this. Let's go, bro. Fine. You boys. Please. <laughs> Whoa. Let us men handle this. Whoa. Okay. Up there. <laughs> right. <laughs> Gotta love how he said that. Whoa, bro. Whoa. Let the man handle this. Well, here it goes. Um, you might want to handle it, man. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Watch out! We have to protect him, aren't we? While David is opening the water gate, cover for him using the gun on top of the guard tower. Okay. I got you. Oh my god, this aim is retarded. I don't like this aim whatsoever, but okay. What a weird crosshair this is. It's such a weird... You have to hit that circle. That circle is all that matters. The rest of it does not matter whatsoever. Only that circle. It's intense. It's intense. David, no! What? Why am I shooting like in between his legs? Also, did he get it? Because I'm just firing like a madman at this point. <laughs> Where'd all the dinos go? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. I rule. Girls drool. Binjo. Look at him strutting like we ain't in a hurry. Watch out! What the hell kind of sound effect was that? I'll save you, bro. <laughs> wow. I'll save you, bro! David! Wow. Wow. Well then. Guess that's the end of David. That was silly as heck. Okay. Oh, look. Almost forgot about you. Home? What did you say? She said, home. Protect the girl from dinosaurs and get across the jungle. Great. Escort mission! My favorite! Okay, well, fuck it. Let's go. Oh, good start. We're off to a good start. God damn it. You move faster. Oh my god. Really, though? Really, though? God damn it. This is the worst. This is already the worst part of the game. We've been doing it for two seconds. Dude! Fuck this! She already got hit like five times! Oh my. 
Why am I? I don't under. Oh my god, this is absurd. This is absurd. No, this is worse than Ashley from RE4. This is worse. For the love of God, this better be it. Because that was absurd. That was the hardest part of the game right there. That was literally the hardest part of the game. I can't even believe I did that on the first try. Assuming that I'm even safe. Nope, not even safe. Nope, she's dead. Wow, this is the hardest part of the game. Wow. Can we use a recess pack? Let me use a recess pack. Yes, please. I'll use it. I'll use it, dude. I might be able to heal her. I didn't even try. Oh my god, really? Uh, I thought it would at least load me on the screen I was on. Nope. Wrong. Yep. Alright, so hopefully I can heal her, because I'm going to use a heal pack on her if I can. Because fuck this part. This already sucks. I'm just going to stay. I'm literally going to stay on top of her. Nope. Nope. Turn. Oh my god, please turn. Dude, are you fucking kidding me right now? Could you lock on the fool? I'm trying to lock on the fool. It's not working. Damn it! Alright, quick, check if you can heal her. Nope, can't heal her. That did not heal her. This is the worst. section of the whole game. Like, this is doable, because I can see where I'm just missing and failing, but, like, I don't know how long this is going to last for, which is the worst part about it. How come I can't climb up there? Um, oh, I have to go around. How is she alive? That was the weirdest, like, whatever just happened ever. Got him. Keep moving, bitch. Keep moving, bitch. Please be it. Please be the end. Come on, man. Don't make me keep doing this. This is the dumbest. I think I did it. Thank God. This is some horse caca mamey doo doo. Not a big fan of this shit. Get fucked, Dino. It's a power terminal for something. Currently, it's not supplying power to anything. Well, then, what's the fucking point? Pray tell. Oh, fuck you. Okay. I guess I'll... Ooh, anti-tank rifle. I forgot about you. Let me try you out. <laughs> Did you hear that? The control terminal for the laser. Currently, four backup blocks are active. Oh, great. Great. Good night. 
Touch the power terminal, you operate. Yes. Holy shit, did you see that? Fucking linebackered my ass. This gun is kick fucking ass is what this gun is. God damn. This is just a raptor fucking den right now. Fuck you. Fuck you. Is this touch panel permit? Huh? Yes, please. Assuming I'm doing this right. Booyah, motherfuckers! Boo! Boo! Wow, I like how it says it's not powering anything right now, except for until you run into the damn thing, and then it's powering something. That's stupid. Oh, man. Uh! This gun is too good. Kicks fucking ass. Damn, get fucked. Get fucked, Raptors. Alright. All terminals deactivated. Boom, mother. Boom, mother. Oh shit, what are you shooting at? I don't even know what the fuck that was. Get it. And we're out of here. Neat. Bye bye. Alright. Ooh. More things to read. Superintendent's will. I knew it would all come to this. There's no way humans and dinosaur could ever coexist. But if we sacrifice our lives now, we would leave a chance for the existence of the human race. The irony is that this whole facility which we are trapped in was built to sustain a suitable environment for the dinosaurs. I am the superintendent of the facility and I am only the, I'm the only one left. I don't belong here. There is no future for this world. The children hurt by the dinosaurs have been put inside life support chambers. I trust that the people of the past will take care of them. The life support chambers are almighty. It should be able to heal any wound, no matter how critical they may be. Also, the life support chambers will feed knowledge and teach them about the world. However, the chambers were originally designed for the growth of dinosaurs. Thus, the knowledge fed will be limited to the knowledge of coexisting with the dinosaurs. The tragedy is that the children will eventually lose their speaking ability, but instead they will have been inputted have been inputted the instincts to protect the dinosaurs. Today I have recorded my message for the man who will definitely come here. With this I have nothing to regret. Weird. Okay. What a weird, weird story this game has. <laughs> the whole wall is lit by indicators of instruments and devices. Never seen him before. <laughs> the future is what you call it. Shits look fucking fancy as heck, man. Where we at right now? Motherfucking S star right now? Fucking S star up in this bitch. Okay, here we go. More to read. Noah's Ark plan, year two thousand nine. Um, you're a little bit. We we kind of passed that about ten years ago in real life. But anyway, it all began in Bolzinia. Bolzinia? Is that a real place? <laughs> Small republic in the southern sea. The first overdrive was the beginning of everything. During transportation, something went wrong, and it resulted in a crack in the space-time which skewed history after the Cretaceous era. To investigate the skewed biological history after the Cretaceous, an extensive experiment was conducted in a global scale. The result? Dot, dot, dot. Devastating. The space-time skew would uh, take its effect on all living organisms. The Earth's history would change dramatically, and the change would wipe the human race from ever existing. That was the conclusion of the experiment. The plan was to transport the living organisms of the Cretaceous through the time gate to a world with similar environments far into the future. After the crisis had passed, the organisms would then be returned to their original time. We called this the Noah's Ark Plan. 
This was the only plan that would leave any chance for the existence of the human race. We hope that this plan is successful, and we shall declare execution of this plan. WAP! Central Council. Many computers are installed for data analysis of experiments. Data analysis of experiments. Experiments. Also some heals and a save. Uh-oh, we ain't done yet. If you're still going to give me more heals and more saves, you know we ain't done yet. Which means we should load up everything we just used. Reload. Okay, I'm reloaded. Charge, please. I'm just glad I got through that escort mission part and I've gotten to save it now. Fuck me. Because that escort mission part was some coarse garbage. You remember when they said there was going to be flying cars in the year 2000? Well then. I think we missed it by, I don't know, about 20 years. Maybe more. <laughs> Probably more. Okay, uh, I guess I can't afford that, so we're going to just save it and move on. Save it and move on, baby. What do we have further up in here? Got another resus pack, because I used one earlier. They're kind of pointless if you save it. The recess packs, like, if you just saved it and then you're gonna die, like, right after that, like, who cares? You can just reload. You're good. It's gonna move you back to the last time you died, anyways. It's not an instant recess pack, you know? Uh. What am I doing in here? Oh. That's a staircase. Totally. You could totally ca tell that that was a staircase. Totally. time left, so I'll explain it short and simple. On August 10th, 2055, our Noah's Ark plan became successful. Year 2055? What's he talking about? To save the dinosaurs, we transferred the dinosaurs to this time, three million years ahead.
use of his health. I am former Special Forces Trad member, Colonel Dylan Morton. What? You're myself in the future? Now it all makes sense. We don't have much time left. There's a gate behind the door. You can use it to return to your time. The gate is not complete yet. You'll be able to use it only once. Please, say hello to Regina for me. I'm counting on you, Lieutenant. What a weird Terminator-ass story this is. Okay. Weird. But we can't leave without Regina, as just stated. If we go through the door without her, doesn't that fuck everything up? I'm confused. Whatever. I'm not gonna worry about it. Oversized transport chamber. Oh, of course. Oh, of course. What? You turned it on. Uh oh. Hello! Just appearing from the darkness. Gotta love how shadows work on a PS1. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, well then. Run, bitch! He gonna kill you! Don't kill you. Get up, fool. Do whatever this panel is going to make you do. Do it. Damage confirmed at oversized transport area. Immediate shutdown. Is that correct? I don't even know. Fuck off, big boy. It's the emergency control terminal to connect the communication line to the anti satellite. Well, yeah, sure. I don't know. Communication line is now connected. I don't know if shooting at this guy is even worth my time. He just gonna keep slapping me, dude. Oh my god. He is just chomp, chomp, chomping away at my ass. Run, bitch, run. He gonna kill you. Dude, seriously right now? Get up! You fool! What are you supposed to do here? Besides run away? Like, is there even another option? <laughs> Shooting him didn't seem to do a goddamn thing. Dude, I can't even get to this terminal. Set the target. Target has been set. Sure. Yes, please. Oh, we're satellite targeting this dinosaur. I get it. Target is set. Dude, what the fuck? What am I even supposed to do right now? Emergency defense has been activated and emergency shutters closed. That's fine. I think that's what we want, right? Oh, fuck me, dude. This is absurd. Weapon, sub. I, I don't know. Must the flamethrower even work? I mean, he didn't like fire before. Is he still not like fire? He even, oh my god, dude, I can't even move! What are you supposed to do here? Like, 
fire ain't working for sure. <sighs> motherfucker, motherfucker. I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Get up, motherfucker. Stop knocking me over. Stop knocking me over. I don't know what I'm doing. Do I have to go to this thing? Yes, start it. Yes, please. Hell, man, this is weird as shit. I beat it. Did he die? Whoa. Oh shit, we're still going. Ah, ah, I thought it was like gonna end there. Okay. Uh Guess we gotta go over to where that emergency thing just went away. Okay. Yes. Jeez. Are we uh are we out of here yet? The gate development lab. GTFO, baby. Sorry, right, dude, you actually haven't had her yet. You'll be fine. Papa. Paula. Dylan, what are we gonna do? If we don't go now, we'll never get back. Regina, the gate is open. I know you don't want to. Are you crazy? Just go, please. You have the third energy data, right? When you get back to our original time, use the data to learn about third energy. Then build the perfect gate and come pick us up for the last time. I... Dylan... I will. I promise. Dylan! Wow. Well then. <laughs> I guess that's Dino. <laughs> I guess that's Dino Crisis 2. Okay. What a weird game. I mean, the gameplay fi is fine. It's, it's, you know, it's everyone a good action game, but for a story, what a weird game. <laughs> Fucking... Dinosaurs with some Terminator shit mixed in, you know. D 
the usual. It's kind of a kick-ass guitar song going on here. Just so I can hear myself think. Um, so that was fucking short as hell. I mean, I expected it to be, but goddamn. Um, yeah. I don't know what to I don't know what to think. So a lot of people love this game. I'm I'm actually I don't know if I should say surprised, but I am kind of surprised people love this game. Isn't it a little bit short? I mean, <laughs> aren't you left a little bit hanging just in terms of content? I don't know, it's the PS1 era. People probably forgave it for just that alone. Um I mean, it has its fun parts and you can, you know, whoop some dinosaur ass, but like Where's the rest of the game at? I feel like this was kind of rushed. Is that the case? I don't even know. I, have no, I don't know shit about the Dino Crisis series other than its existence. I don't know its development process. I don't know what they were going for. Because the first game was very much a Resident Evil type of game. It took longer than this game took. And then this game existed. And it was like, let's make a more run and gun kill dinos. Like, that's fine. And that's fun and everything. But like, wow, it's short. I don't know. The game's fine, I guess. A lot, like I said, a lot of people who are watching this right now are probably going to be mad at me because I don't love it, or I don't. I don't know if you think I should love it. I don't know. I feel like it's okay. It's a decent game. I think I like the first one better just because it's more like Resident Evil, which I enjoy that more puzzly survival horror aspect more than I enjoy this run and gun on PS1 style game. But that doesn't necessarily make it bad. It just makes it okay. It's interesting though to check this game out because I. I was, I was curious after I played the first one because a lot of people wanted me to play the second one because they said it's so different. Now I know. Now I know. I'm just... I, I'm, the biggest thing is I'm glad I finally knocked the games out just in general because they've been sitting in my backlog on my PS3 forever. You know, I bought a bunch of PS1 games on the PSN for like a dollar a piece like a while, while back. And this was one of them, including the first game. So I'm just glad I finally got to play them. I also just noticed that Shinji Mikami was on this game. Somebody told me that in the comments as well. He made a lot of games during this era, man. He was a Resident Evil master, making Dino Crisis, and making all the games for, like, all the action games that come later, like the, Di the Devil May Cry situations and stuff like that. Yeah. <sighs> good times. Good times. Do I actually have a backlog list? I mean... Huh, hold on. Clear time. Four hours and 45 minutes. So I beat it in sub five. Not bad. Five hours was the amount of whatever. Also, I missed one dino file. Really? That's unfortunate. I wonder where I missed it. It's probably just inside of some shit I didn't examine, which is... I found about three that way. I'm sure Jen is going to be mad at me because I didn't find them all. I don't know what the bonus would have been, but apparently there's a bonus if you get all the dino files. I don't know what that bonus is. Probably just one of these things. A bonus game, Dino Coliseum. It's probably something that pops up here. I'm assuming this is some kind of extra bonus mode that you can just kill dinosaurs endlessly in. I'm assuming. Um, player entry. Uh, okay. Did I... Oh. What? Anyway, this is the guy. These are the guys from the first game. And this is a tank. Oh, for this is a Coliseum. Yeah, fuck yeah, I want the tank. I can afford all these guys actually. Oh shit! Oh moly. Okay, well I can't afford any of these guys, but now I know. Need more points. So this is the reason to play the game again if you want to unlock all the stuff for the Coliseum. Got it. Weird game. Weird game. I'll just save over the early save. It's fine. And that's it, folks. Re uh, Resident. Resident Crisis of Dinos complete. <laughs> We're done here. Extra Crisis is a minigame Dino Coliseum. Okay. Interesting. So anyways, that's the game. I hope you guys enjoyed the playthrough. It's been a time. Um, I'll mention real quick, I am aware that there's a Dino Crisis 3. I know even less about that than I did the first two, which is saying a lot because I didn't know shit about these first two games. Well, I knew a little bit about the first one, but the second one, not so much. Um, but the third one, I've, I've just recently been made aware, made aware of its existence when I was looking at some stuff about the series, and I was like, oh, there is a third game. I don't know if it's any good. I don't know if people played it. I 
don't know anything about it. I don't own it, and I don't know an easy way to play it other than having the actual disc from, I think it's like a Xbox game or a PS2 game. I'm not sure if it's on both or one or the other. But either way, that's it, folks. Um, I don't plan on playing that game, by the way, I just, unless I end up having it someday, but that's all I wanted to point out. Um, yeah, so that's it for this playthrough. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys on something different. February is coming up. Get ready. See you guys then. Peace.